we're starting. All right, we're starting and we're good to go. We're very, very good to go. So we'll be learning how to convince people to be part of your business. How to convince people to be part of your business. You want to take down some very valuable notes. And this is just the part one. This is just the part one. The first thing I want you to write down is that there are two sets of people we have the influencer and the in we have people who are influencers in societies, influencers. Good evening. Uh, let's wait for Mr. George. He's trying to connect his phone back. Um, let's just wait for him a bit. He will join us soon. Please kindly mute your mic. Kindly mute your mic, please. If you're just coming, kindly mute your uh, mute your mic, please. All right, guys, I'm back. I'm fully back. I It's a call actually uh, trying their best to disrupt this meeting. Okay, so let's do this finally. All right. Okay. Let's make this happen. Okay, so so you're either buying, you're either buying or you are selling. You're either buying or you are selling. So how do you how to convince anyone to do your business or to join your projects or to participate in your projects? Let's begin. Now I want to introduce you to something very, very powerful. I want you to, to take your pen and your biro and write it down. This is the secret of raising money. This is the secret of getting anything that you want. It is a code that very few people have realized, very few people know that it's powerful. That first code is called 
CTP and TTMP code. TTP and TTMP code. Now, somebody was asked one day, top speaker by the name Les Brown, what is the secret of success? What is the secret of getting what you want in life? What is the secret of getting people to support your project? And he said to the person, TTP and TTMP code. So the question now is, what is TTP? It is very simple. You have to learn to talk to people. You cannot get any results. You cannot get the money you're looking for if you don't know how to talk to people. And even if you know how to talk to people and you don't talk to people, you will not get any results. So when they ask Les Brown, oh, okay, is that all? Just to talk to people? What if I talk to people and it does not acquire, get the results I'm looking for? Or they refuse to participate in my business? Les Brown said to him, you have to use TTMP. What does TTMP mean? It means talk to more people. That is the secret of sales. That is the secret of winning. Talk to more people. If you want to get results, it's a game of numbers. If you want to get results in sales, it's a game of numbers. So when we are using TTMP, remember TTMP means talk to more people. There is a vertical approach that is up and down and there is horizontal approach. What do we mean by vertical approach? Let me start with horizontal approach first. Okay, let's talk about vertical approach. That means that if you're going to talk to anybody, you may need to talk to a person repeatedly. You may need to talk to a person repeatedly, one-on-one, -on -one, repeatedly. You talk to the first person, talk to the second person, talk to the third person, talk to one-on-one, on one-on-one -on -one, on -one -on -one case. Maybe you had a conversation with somebody about your product, about your business, about e-cooperative, about whatever business you're doing, one-on-one. -on -one. Then you go to meet another person. That one, you know, the British would call it one-to-one. -one. Americans would say one-on-one. -on -one. So that one-to-one -one or one-on-one -on -one approach is vertical. You know, you're meeting one person at a time. You will get results eventually. It's called the vertical approach. It's powerful. It has its own limitation, but it's also the one to many, one to many. So there's one on one or one to one and one to many. The one to many is called the horizontal approach, where you're speaking to people like I'm doing right now, one, not, but not one person, but to as many people as possible. That one has its own advantages. That one has its own um, disadvantages, its own pros, its own cons. You need to understand it. So the idea basically is if you're going to win, if you're going to get people to do business with you, then you need to TTP or TTMP. The question going at the back of your mind, how do you effectively TTP? And how do you effectively do TTMP? How do you speak to people vertically and get results? And how do you speak to people horizontally as you want to many and get results? One of the ways you can speak to one to many is through digital marketing, through Facebook advertising, through social media, through YouTube, through Zoom, like we're doing. You have people come together and then you speak to them at the same time. Now, let's begin to move on further to look at something. There's something that Jim Ron calls the law of rituals. And I want you to pay attention to this. It says that one in every 10 persons will say yes to you. In sales, when you want to, when you want to start selling, because we're talking about TTP, when you start selling, one of the things they tell you is that if you speak to the first person, the chances are that the person will tell you no. Because of course, the person is just hearing for the first time, or the person doesn't know you yet, or the person doesn't know the business yet. So one in 10 persons. So you need to talk to the first person, the second person, the third person, the fourth person, the fifth person, the sixth person. By the time you get to the 10th person, you'll get your first yes. That means you're going to get nine no's before you get your first yes. And that is because you are an amateur or you're an amateur. So one in 10 persons will say no to you. So don't be surprised. Some people have private chatted me that, ah, man, I've tried this networking thing. I've tried to refer people out to business. I've gone, ah, man, I've gotten so many no's, many no's. It is very normal. One in 10 persons will say yes to you. Remember that one in 10 persons will say yes to you. If you just join us, please mute your mic. In the sense, so if I want to get 10 persons to join my business, I want to get 10 persons to support, to participate in my business, what do I do? I need to speak to 100 people. 
I need to speak to 100 people so that I can get 10 persons. But this thing gets more interesting. This thing gets more interesting. This is what, gets, this is what happens. By the time you get to your 40th person, by the time you do your 40th presentation on a one-to-one -one or one-on-one -on -one basis to the person you do, the one-on-one -on -one basis to different people, one-on-one, -on one 40th person, you would realize that you become you would have become so good that the ratio would increase from one to one to two to okay one to ten or one in ten to two in ten. What that means is that every time you talk to ten persons, subsequently two people will say yes and eight people may say no. The reason being that as you have been talking forty times to different people, you are getting better. You yourself, you're even understanding the business better. You're now doing, oh, okay, these are the distinctions. They have asked you certain questions. You have now gone to meet your offline or the person who is telling you to talk about the business or you're going to do your research and you're understanding better. So by the time you speak to 40 people, you would have moved up from one in 10 to two in 10. It's simple mathematics. Now, by the time you get to your 60th person, you see, people don't, these businesses don't fail, people give up. Businesses don't fail, people give up. People stop talking to people. The most important thing about business is sales, is talking to people. The moment you stop talking to people, your business folds up. By the time you get to your 60th person talking about that same presentation, you would have moved from two in 10 to three in 10. That means when you talk to 10 people, three will say yes. At this point, you have moved from amateur to professional. At this point, you have moved from amateur to professional. So you don't have to be a skillful seller. You don't have to be a good talker. All you have to do is talk to people about your presentation, about your product. Keep talking about the compensation plan. The compensation plan. Keep talking, keep talking, keep talking. As you are talking, you'll be having new ideas, having new understanding, having new insight, having new distinction. Just keep talking. Just keep talking, keep talking. You'll be coming better. You'll be coming better. You'll be coming better. And by the time you're now doing three in 10, you talk to 10 people, three will say yes. At that point, you are now a professional. You have grown to a professional. Now, I want to say this. This is very common in traditional marketing. That is when you go and sell your normal goods. You want to sell a project or you want to sell normal goods, just normal traditional marketing. One in 10 says yes. In network marketing, one in 20 say yes. You didn't hear me. One in 10 say yes in traditional business. But when it comes to network marketing, one in 20 say yes, because a lot of people don't like network marketing. A lot of people don't like referral business. A lot of people don't like to, they don't like to lead. They like to be solo. They don't want any stress. They don't want to be responsible for people. So when you tell them, ah, so you have a lot of rejection. So network marketers at the beginning have a lot of rejection. But the beautiful thing is that if they can persist and get that one person in 20 who can understand the opportunity, who can understand the business, the sky is their beginning place. So we call it, so now you don't have to be skillful. The law of retro says that you make up in number what you lack in skill. If you don't have a selling skill, if you don't have a talking skill, if you don't have the ability to convince people, don't worry, just talk to people about the business. Whatever you heard your master taught you or your upline taught you or the person who taught you, introduced you to business, just keep talking, just share like that. Just keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing. You will make up in number what you lack in skill. So it's about the number. If I want to get 10 people to sign up in my business, I need to talk to 200 people. And I can talk to 200 people in different formats. I can talk to them one-on-one -on -one, or I can talk to them one-to-many with Zoom with WhatsApp, wow. with Facebook advertising, I can talk to that 200 sets of people at a go. That is the power of this business. All right, I wrote something on Facebook yesterday and I said that I want you to write it down in your notes. It's very, a very powerful quote. If you invest your energy and knowledge in one person so that they understand network marketing, they could bring you a nation. If you invest your energy and knowledge 
in one person so that they understand network marketing, they could bring you in. By the way, for those of you who have joined us before, we have said emphatically that if you're truly going to succeed, you need leverage. Yesterday, David and Mayan talked about leverage, the leverage of people. People, one is too small a number to achieve greatness. It takes teamwork to make your dream work. There is no dream that you have that people will not make it work for you. So you need to have relationship intelligence. You need to learn to work with people. You need to lead people. There's no way you can succeed at the rate at which you want to succeed without working with people. Now, if you are dedicated to helping just one person to become that leader, becoming that one person to have knowledge, that person can go and bring a nation. I share the example of Jesus, that Jesus one of those days went to the well and he spoke to a woman in the water of Samaria. And before you knew it, that woman went and brought the whole of Samaria. For those, for those of you who are Bible students or who are Christians, you have heard that story. That's a very powerful quote. I'd like to make another very powerful quote. You see, it's also very important to understand that the cooperative platform also uses the network marketing model. We cannot deny it. Yes, use the network marketing model because it's a very, very powerful model. For those of you who have been following, we have taught about the, the industry results of network marketing. That network marketing is a $200 billion a year industry. We have also said that Bill Gates, Donald Trump, Richard Branson, Warren Buffett have all endorsed network marketing. They say that if they had the opportunity to start again, they would do network marketing. So network marketing for, for information is a reliable business that can work, that can make you successful, that can give you leverage. So I also said in a quote yesterday that network marketing businesses do not fail. People in the system give up. Systems or business opportunities that you have and you know about, that you talk about, they do not fail actually. It is people in the system that stop talking to people and they stop talking to more people. They allow rejection to get at them. In this business, rejection is a part of the success process. The reason why people don't accept your business because they don't understand yet. They don't have insight and don't have knowledge. So you must embrace rejection. You must embrace it. In fact, the rejection will begin from your family members. The rejection will begin from your friends, people that you expect to know. Ah, this thing, you know, there was, but later on, when you now start succeeding, when you start making all the money and all the good things, they will not, ah, they will tell, oh, ah, you would have forced us now. Ah, you would have pushed us now. Ah, you know that we are family. Why do you succeed alone? So network marketing businesses don't fail. It is people in the system that give up. So I want to teach you now how to ask and get what you want, what you asked for. How to ask from somebody and get what you ask for. I'm going to stop there today and then talk about this powerful business. How to ask and get what you want uh, from anybody. A few things you must understand. Number one, when it comes to asking people for something, you must learn how to ask specifically. Learn how to ask specifically. Learn how to ask specifically. In all that you do in your business, be very specific. If someone tells you that, oh, that, okay, you're trying to invite him for, I want to have a meeting with him. You've called him, you want, to have, you want to book an appointment with him for anything. And the person tells you, okay, let us see next week. You ask him, sir, what time next week? He says, uh, Monday, Tuesday. He says, can I call you on Tuesday, you know, or can I call you on Monday to remind you of today's meeting? He says, yes, 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 yes. Sir, what time on, on Tuesday? Uh, I'm not very sure, but let's say 4 p.m. Sir, should I call you by 12 noon to, to confirm the meeting? Uh, by 4 p.m. That way you are asking, you're trying to become more specific in all that you do. When you want to get for anything in life, be very specific. Make sure that your goals are specific. Nothing is dynamic unless it is first specific. Life responds to specificity. Specificity, that means life responds to you being specific. What exactly do you want? Now, I want to ask you a question. What do you want in this business? What do you want out of life? What will 4.6 million Naira do for you? What will about $10,000, what will about $10,000 do for you? Where would you go? Be specific. Be specific. How, when do you want to achieve that goal? Just be specific. What do you want from people? Learn to be specific because if you're not specific, you're not going to get what you want. All right? Now, that's the first thing. Choose. Number two, when you want to ask, 
When you want to ask, you must learn how to ask from someone who can help you or someone who can support or someone who can contribute or someone who can give you. Not everybody should be asked from. Not everybody is your customer. In this business, we don't get everybody. We sort, we sort, we choose, we choose people because the people that we choose are potential leaders. The people that we choose are potential leaders. So you ask from someone who can help you. And this is general now, whatever it is you want to do. Don't just ask specifically, ask from somebody who can support, who can help you. It is very important, very important. You know, don't just walk up to anybody, walk from somebody, you know, you identify this person can support, this person can participate, this person can contribute, this person can buy. You ask, you, 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 you do what's called customer analysis. You find out whether this person is the right person to talk to. You do your, your, your targeting. You've analyzed before you now go, okay, this person is the kind of person that will do business with me or will support my, my vision and so on. So ask from someone who can help you. Number three, when you are asking, don't beg. The best way to ask is not to beg. The best way to ask is to ask in exchange of value. Ask in exchange of value. When people realize that you're coming for their mercy, you're, coming, you're, you're trying for them to show you mercy, they will treat you anyhow. They will treat you anyhow. Oh, please, now do my business now. It's not just okay. Do the business now. No, that is not the approach. What you need to learn to do is to communicate the value. Communicate the value and get the person you're asking to see the value of what you are asking for. That if you give me that, you will get this. Life is a give and take. Let them see the value. Oh, that is amazing. We'll take. Oh, that's amazing. Take. So your job as a seller, your job as a referrer, your job as an inviter, your job as a network marketer, your job as an entrepreneur, your job as an intrapreneur, your job as a distributor is to teach people to help the customer, help the prospect, help the client to see value that this thing I'm giving to you is so valuable. The moment they see it, exchange will occur. The moment customers see the value, exchange will occur. So ask in exchange of value. Give them value, then ask for it. Number three, ask with faith and congruency. You see, there are some people that you go and ask for 10 million and they look at you and say, this guy, you don't look like someone that, because of the way your, your voice is shaking, your physiology is not, in, you're not composed. You're going to ask for 10 millionaire and they're looking at you and wondering, are you sure this person can handle 10 millionaire? So when you're asking from anybody, as long as you've communicated the value, ask with faith and congruency. There has to be congruency in your voice. There has to be congruency in your body. You have to dress the way you know that that money you're asking for, you can get. So ask in faith and congruency. You can write the word congruency and then go and Google it up and find out what that means. Now, number three, Ask until, ask until. Remember I said that one in 10 persons will say yes in traditional marketing. One in 20 people will say yes in network marketing. Why is there a difference? In normal business, when you sell, okay, maybe I think that's what even leads to our, uh, okay, that's okay, I'll discuss that. Let me just discuss that. In normal businesses or never normal buying and selling, if you give, if you meet a person and say, oh, please, I, I have a, um, I want to buy a product from you. The person sells you his, um, his shoe or his bag and you give him money. Chicken business has done, is over. You are his customer. You have bought the product from him and you have gone. That is it. But in network marketing, it's not like that. When you convince a person to buy your product and the person is about to go, you call him back and say, Biko, come back. Mbok, come back. Joe, come back. Come back first. It's not just about the product. If you go out and bring, do what I have done, the company will also pay you. The company will give you this value. That is more difficult. So you're not just getting customers, you're raising leaders. Network marketing is not just about recruiting customers or, or selling to customers. It is recruiting and selling to leaders, making sure that a person will join you and become a leader and do the same thing that you have done. In our business, is four, bring four and upgrade. Four, bring four. The four you're bringing have to equally understand it so that they can also bring their own four. And that is what leaders do. And that's a little difficult. Nobody wants to lead. Everybody wants to just be solo. 
So that can be challenging. That's why one in 20 people in network marketing will say yes. So you keep asking until you get what you want. Keep asking, asking, asking until you can get the right people. So I want to teach you marketing models. There are different styles. I'm going to take this tomorrow to the next level where I will teach you how to persuade people. And I will teach you the six different kinds of customers or prospect. And when you go out to market, when you're talking to people on phone, when you're doing WhatsApp, the different the six people that you meet and how to answer them and how to tackle them and how to get them to buy into whatever it is you're saying. I will teach you that tomorrow. All right. But let's look at some marketing models, how to market people so that they can join your business, so they can participate, they can buy your product, buy your service. Number one marketing model is called relationship marketing. Relationship marketing. What is relationship marketing? Now, relationship marketing is when you use relationship, when your, your goal is not to sell to them, your goal basically is to form a bond with them first. You don't try to sell them, they're not your customers, you want to form a bond with them. You want to connect with them, I'll teach you that tomorrow or, or in the subsequent days. You want to form a bond with them first, so you do the relationship marketing approach. How are you doing? What's up? How, how is business? Hmm. There's an opportunity, I think, that can help you in your business. So, so you're coming from the niceties, the pleasantries, so that you can sell to them. It's called relationship marketing. A few things we want to consider when it comes to relationship marketing. I wrote this yesterday on... Okay, and I think it's a petition. I said, if you invest your energy and knowledge in one person so that they understand network marketing, they could bring you a nation. We already said that, all right? I also said this. Why do you want to invest in building relationships? Why do you want to use the relationship model? Why do you want to be relationship intelligence? Have relationship intelligence. I taught you that last time, that relationship intelligence is your ability to attract quality people to attract and retain quality people, you know, to work with people, to find quality people, to synergize. I, I've taught you that before, all right? So the greatest gift a person can give you is access to his network, access to his network. Access is granted only when you connect with them at a deep level. You must be nice. You must be cautious. You must be nice. Some people may be rude to you, but you have to be nice. You have to be friendly to them so that you can do business. So we call relationship marketing. It's a powerful market. So I already explained this earlier, the difference between traditional marketing and network marketing. Traditional marketing is mostly transactional. Traditional marketing is mostly transactional. You just do the business, get your money, and you go. But network marketing is mostly relational. You have to build relationships because those relationships you build can evolve into something that will bring you more and more people. That's why network marketing is a powerful business model. It's not just transactional, it's relational. It's relational. Network marketing is also transactional, but it is more relationship than it is transactional. All right. So that said, so I also said this about, you know, in the quote I put out yesterday on Facebook, I said, network marketing businesses fail because more people want to be investors in a referral system than become leaders. Oh, this is so powerful. You need to write this down. You know, when people, people think that network marketing is an investment opportunity. No, there are investment opportunities. Even eCooperative.Africa has investment opportunities where you can invest, where you can put your money and then the money will multiply for you or it will grow for you. You know, there are businesses like that. There are forex businesses, there are crypto businesses, there are agricultural businesses you can invest. I put that want to just invest. It's nothing bad or wrong about it. But when you're doing a referral business, the thing that's called to question is your leadership. You have to be checking your metrics every now and then. Check the four, check the 16, check the 64, 32, 5. You have to be calling people. You have to be, you have to invest your energy in people. The truth is that if you can work with people effectively, these people that join you in your business, your current business, the e-cooperative business will follow you to any other business you're doing. Don't you know that? You have access to their details. They'll follow you. And that's so beautiful. I know that some of you don't like network marketing, but trust me, if you're going to be rich, brand, um, Richard Brown, uh, no, Richard Brunton, Robert Kiyosaki says that network marketing is a business of the 21st century. Robert G. Allen says that network marketing is the ultimate money-making machine. You want to accelerate your results, you want to get crazy results, you need to look at that space. You need to look at that space. All right.
So let me say a few other things. There's also another kind of uh, model. I'm talking about the, the relationship model, building relationships to people, which is important. The second kind of model is the teaching model. Oh, I love this part. And that's me teaching. I love to teach. I said something very striking. And that thing is this. I also posted it on my Facebook wall. I said that people may resist a sales pitch, but they would embrace the gifts of knowledge. People resist a sales pitch, but they will embrace the gift of knowledge. Teach before you sell. Now, for, I, I, I grew up in Lagos, and usually those days when I didn't have a vehicle, I, I would enter into uh, Molue, and then or one of these vehicles, you know, maybe BRT or one of these vehicles. And then you see somebody, a man will stand up, who say, uh, uh, good evening, or oh, I greet you special. Notice one thing those people do. They will not start selling their products. They will first teach you. They will say, ah, if you have diabetes, they will teach you about diabetes. They will tell you about the problem. They will educate you somewhat about that problem before they now say, ah, I have one drugs, one powerful herb, one powerful drug that can cure any jedi, jedi, any diabetes. Before they start announcing their product, they will enlighten you a bit. So even at the local level, they know that you have to give value by way of teaching before you sell. So teaching is a higher form of selling. Teaching is a higher form of selling. Teaching is, a, is better than selling. It is better than selling because you are impacted. When you go out to, ah, come on, do my business. Come on, do my business. Come on, do my business. They will run away from you. Ah, they don't come again, not them. But when you are perceived as a sales consultant, as a health expert, as a financial expert, they will embrace you all. You're trying to solve, show them how they can understand money. Show them how they can understand life. Show them how they can understand lifestyle, communication, personal development, leadership. They're excited. Every business has a teaching dimension. So if you're a fashionista, maybe you have a fashion shop, rather than try to sell your clothes and struggle and struggle, you can use another angle. You can be teaching about fashion on Facebook, sharing some beautiful statistics, some beautiful um, information about origin of wares, just by giving that information on a regular basis and updating it on your Facebook, updating it on your WhatsApp, on your WhatsApp status, on your Facebook status. People will not say, oh, this person has so much knowledge about fashion. That means you will know how to, the product she's selling is what it. So whatever you're selling, explore the educational part of it before you sell. You must learn how to teach you. That's the teaching model. Now there's the last one called the leadership model of marketing. The leadership marketing model. What that means that as you meet people, your goal is to make them a leader. Leaders multiply your results. Stop looking for followers. You know, stop looking for recruits. Stop keep, you know, you're recruiting, you're recruiting, you're recruiting, you're recruiting, and then you just make some money from recruiting them and then you're out of it. No, leaders focus on one person, focus on two person, focus on three or four and make sure that they replicate. In this business of success, in this business of referral, in this business of network marketing, we've got to get people to do what we have done. When they do what we have done, we'll multiply. That's why network marketing is like a virus. I was discussing with some of the executives of e cooperative and they said, look, that the system is duplicating, 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 that is spreading like wildfire because leadership is involved. So if your business is not working, you are not leading. Let me show you something very important. Everything rises and falls on your leadership. Everything. Everything rises and falls on your leadership. If your business is working, if you are doing well in any network marketing you're doing, including e-cooperative or in business because you are a leader. Network marketing particularly reveals or exposes your leadership or relationship deficiency. Network marketing reveals or exposes your leadership or relationship deficiency. Ah, sir, I've spoken to people, oh, they're not following me. Ah, you're not the leader. You're not the leader that you say you are. People must follow you because leadership is influence. Leadership is the ability to obtain followers. Leadership is influence. Leadership is the ability to obtain followers. Leadership is 
influence that leads to affluence. It is first influence, then it becomes affluence. You must lead people. A Chinese proverb once said that he who thinks he leads and has nobody following him is only taking a stroll. You must learn leadership. And what network marketing helps you to do is it helps you to lead, help you to work with people, help you to take all kinds of insults, help you to take help, help you to build your emotional intelligence. Because when people tell you no, it can be damaging to your mind. But because you have learned emotional maturity, you handle it. You know, it helps you to fail and stand up again. It helps you to set goals. It helps you to form teams. Help you to synergize, help you to work. That's why network marketing is a good business. Before you do any physical business, any traditional business, I would encourage you to do a network marketing business. Do a network marketing business because it will help you to grow your leadership. I mean, there's a book titled Business School by Robert Kiyosaki, and it talks a lot about the eight values, the eight values of network marketing. And I was talking to some students the other day, young people, I said, look, I'll tell you, if I knew this when I was young, if I knew the power of working with people, of teamwork, of synergizing, of leveraging on people as a young person, I'll be a multi-billionaire by, by now. People who are smart, who know it, have done it. So it's not too late to build a network of people to work with a team and grow your team. So let me quickly introduce you to eCooperative.Africa. Now, the beautiful thing about eCooperative Africa is that it has all of these things. Up. It gives you the opportunity to have all these things. For example, eCooperative Africa, it gives you the opportunity to download very powerful resource materials. This thing have taught you and many more, many, many, many more from different resource persons around Nigeria, around Africa, who have quality, whose product, if you were to buy it, it will cost you a lot of money. But just by registering with 2,000 naira, just 2,000 naira, just urgent 2K that you get and then you use anyhow, or you throw away, you have access to these materials which you can download and read, you can download and watch, you can download and you know download and use for your own benefit, like how to attract customers, how to do digital marketing, Instagram, importation and exportation, you have all of it. For every, for every upgrade that you have, there are resources and materials packed for you. So when you pay or when you support your upline with 2,000 and the first value that you get are those products. I was asking somebody the other day, do you value training? Do you value knowledge? If you value knowledge, realize that knowledge is a product. Information is a product. People pay heavily for those courses, but you have access to it through the eCooperative.Africa platform. So that's the website, by the way, and then you can see it. So the product, when they say the eCooperative doesn't have product, number one, eCooperative is e e email. E e e commerce, as in e corporate is an online commerce, online cooperative. Therefore, the products are predominantly online. So the first thing you notice about e cooperative is that they have e learning access to courses, to videos, to audios, to training. Some of you have not even downloaded. You don't want to do network. Go and see that the value. Go and download and see. E-commerce, once you register with 2K into the business, you have the opportunity to sell and to buy your own products. In other words, you can sell your products, you can buy from other people, you can upload your own products on the system, and people from all over Nigeria, all over Africa will buy them. Then there are also e-savings, that means you can save disciplines and plans savings. Then there's e-investment and there's crowdfunding. So when people ask you about the product of e-cooperative, that's it there. E-learning, e-commerce, e-savings, e-investment, crowdfunding. E-learning, e-commerce, e-savings, e-investment, crowdfunding. We are online. We are online. We have competitors. Like, I, I want to mention their names because we must respect them. They're doing very well. Like Prosper, like, um, like iMoney, like um, Kuda, Kuda Bank, like uh, um, Piggy Vest, like Carry Wise, like Cobo. But you see, our own is revolutionary. We're not just coming to do savings like they are doing. We're doing savings. We're doing e-learning, we're doing e-commerce, we're doing e-savings, we're doing e-investment, we're doing crowdfunding. And that is the unique selling point of e-cooperative. That's what separates us from every other. We have accepted 
accepted and adopted the multi-level marketing opportunity. So that is the business for you. Now, I want you to see something. Another thing that you can use e-cooperative to do is that you can use e-cooperative to raise funds. Let us say you want to raise 8,000 now. Through the e-cooperative platform, you can raise 8,000 now. Let us say that you want to raise uh, um, 64,000 now. Through the e-cooperative, you can raise 64,000 now. Let us say you want to raise 512,000 now. Through the e-cooperative platform, you can raise 512,000 now. Let us say you want to raise 4.96,000 now. Through the e-cooperative platform, you can raise 4.96,000 4 now. They have created a system that can make that possible. They have created a system that can make that possible. Like I already said earlier, e-cooperative also enables you to save. You can buy from the platform and you can also invest from the platform. Now, I'm going to go quickly to show you before, I'm going to go quickly to show you the compensation plan of this business. What makes this business so sweet? What makes this business so sweet so that we can take some questions? What makes this business um, an interesting business so that we can take some questions. Now, give me a minute. I'll be with you shortly. I'm going to just share with you my um, slides and show you the compensation plan quickly. The compensation plan quickly. All right. So we're going there, going back again. Sorry. Let's do this again. The compensation plan quickly. Uh, okay. 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 Just a minute. Okay. Let me show you the compensation plan of this business. Every day for every day for the next 30 days, we will be showing you different knowledge. Like you see, I have 200, almost 300 slides done for you. I will teach you, explain, expose a lot of things to you that will help you to become better, you know, as a member of e-cooperative. For some people who have joined us already, this has been shared, but for emphasis and to help people, we will teach it again and again. Just a minute, let me show you that compensation plan. The compensation plan should be somewhere here. Okay, okay. we are just about there. All right, so this is where we're going to start. So, all of you have just this conversation plan. All right, so how do you now join the business? How do you participate? What are the requirements for registration? First of all, for you to register, you need to have a sponsor. Who is a sponsor? A sponsor is someone whose referral link you use to sign up. So somebody needs to refer you. Somebody needs to refer you. So you, your referral link is in your dashboard. You go down, you see a referral link. You can share your referral link with your people who want to participate in the business, all right? So you're following the second thing that you need to have as an individual in this business is that you need to have a phone number for now a Nigerian bank, for long in Nigerian bank accounts and an email address because they're gonna send mails to you. They're gonna send mails, um, phone number. Most of you receive phone um, um, text messages today because e-cooperative has your details, all right? A bank account. And so you're gonna work with that. All right, the marketing plan is simple. E-Cooperative has created a very simple plan that can enable you to grow your community and equally make money from it. So what E-Cooperative is saying, learn how to invite four people. Just invite four people and then you are good to go. Learn how to invite four people. Now, tomorrow, this topic I've treated today, I'll take it to the next level. How to convince people to join your product part two. In that point, I'll be talking about the psychology of humans, how human beings think how to identify people's emotional agenda. We'll look at what you can look out for, how you can strongly, what I think you can use to strongly connect to people so that you can invite them, how to identify people who can participate in your business. We'll look at that tomorrow. But here you have to invite four people to join your business, all right? And you're going to be good to go. The moment you, you join four people, you give your upline 2,000 Naira, who as you know, once you register, you're, you're on level zero, but then you take out 2,000 and you upgrade to level one by giving to your upline. The system will give you a digital marketing tool on your dashboard. And you have access to savings, e-commerce, and the investment platform. So let's look at this diagram quickly. I want you to pay attention. If you're just joining, pay attention now. This is where you need to understand. You need to understand this is how, this is the...
system that e-cooperative has is if once when you are in this one level zero, but level zero to level one, you have to give somebody two thousand. You have to support a person's project with two thousand. And e-cooperative says, don't give it to us. Don't give the money to the cooperative. <laughs> give the money to a member of the cooperative who is already in the system. So you take your two thousand and give to let's call that beautiful lady Jane. You give it to Jane, and then, you it to and then she upgrades. You give her two thousand and then she upgrades you to level one. The the e-cooperative model says bring four persons, and then you go to go and invite. Just copy your link. You know, meet up, talk to people, get them to be interested in the business, get them interested in joining the cooperative, in supporting others. And as they join the cooperative, each of them will give you two two thousand naira. One person will give you two thousand. The second person will give you two thousand. The third person will give you two thousand. The fourth person will give you two thousand. And that means you will make a total of eight thousand naira. Now, the people that are giving you to 2,000 are equally on their dashboard access to the resources that you also had. Please, if you're just joining us, could you kindly mute your mic? Mute your mic, please. If you're just joining, could you kindly please mute your mic? Thank you. Mr. George will still join us. Let's just wait for him to connect back. No, don't don't miss me. They don't hear me. Listen to face. Thank you. 
Mr. David, are you there? Mr. David? Okay, let me see you, are you there? Hello, I'm here. Okay. Okay, you're there, right? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, please take over, take over, please. Is it me? Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, Mr. I don't know if you can hear me, but if you can, my name is Shalai Kirete. I I joined the meeting, I think about 10 minutes into the into the discussion. And uh, from what uh, George Yesena said so far, I've been able to I've, I've been able to get some details concerning the marketing models. And I hope I'll be able to, I'll be able to participate in the meeting as, as it's ongoing. Tomorrow, I'm probably to the end. Hello, good evening, everyone. Thank you so much for staying put up until now. We're very sorry for a bit of technicalities that has been happening in the back end. We're trying to make sure that we get um, Dr. George ACN join us back online. However, um, we're pretty excited at the fact that um, most of us or all of us that joined, irrespective of when we joined, uh, we've been able to get a thing or two from the conversation ongoing. Uh, we appreciate everyone's cordial um, coordination. We're really excited about that. Um, just a few notices. Um, when you join an online webinars like this, it is advisable for security reasons and for professionalism to ensure that um, if you must use your video, then your background must be somewhere very nice, not um, a little bit too dark or um, kind of exposing some unnecessary part of your probably house. And then of course, it's very important, irrespective of the fact that you are at your house, you should try and put your shirt on or your dress on because you don't know, some your hands might just touch your gadget and your video might just turn back on. That's something we always advise when we are in a Zoom meeting because uh, moving forward, the world has changed into virtual community where most likely everything we do is gonna be going virtual. So as much as possible, we try to also get ourselves acquainted to that fact and get um, ready to also stay professional at it. 
we've learned so far tonight about um, relationship marketing. It has to do with more building relationship as a person, um, as it regards to your business, as it regards to your products. Uh, so beyond um, trying to sell to someone um, for the purpose and the emphasis of just selling, be, be interested in that person, especially if it's your customer. So your customer is, of course, is supposed to buy from you. And um, apart from buying from you, you should go beyond being interested in the person buying from you to also knowing how the person is feeling. Say, for example, we have two people that are working in the same in the same complex but different bosses. Boss A has the habit of always asking his staff, how are you doing? How's your wife? How are your children? What class are they today? Then the other boss doesn't care, doesn't ask. Just get sure the job is done. It's obvious that you would definitely, you would definitely want to work for boss A because boss A usually, most times, always, always um, tries to find out how you're doing. So that it is about um, relationship marketing as against transactional marketing. Transactional marketing is, hey, a guy go buy today, you know, go buy. If you're not buying, no hello. It's when you buy that they hail you as a boss. So, so that's something that um, Dr. George is trying to also explain George to us. Back. Can you make him admin? Okay, so um, I'll just keep talking until he takes over. I cannot make George admin from my end here. But then um, as we look forward to having Mr. George back, it's very important that we write down some of those things that Dr. George has been sharing with us. And then he talked about leadership. Um, leadership is, 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 is all about influence. And influence is not about authority, authoritativeness. Rather, it's about having empathy for people, having genuine interest for people. If you are a person that has a genuine interest for people, then you will automatically begin to command influence in the life of those people. And I think Dr. George is almost always almost back. My name is Kingsley and I'm glad to have this standing still for Dr. George. And I hope that um, his mic is on now so he can take over from me. Um, thank you Kingsley for what you just shared. Do you, does that mean that I was not, I was not showing you guys anything. Did you guys see my screen? Wow. Yeah, we, yeah we, saw, we, saw, we saw your screen. You were actually taking us through to the network marketing plan. And it was at a network marketing plan that, um, you know, um, your, you, you got seized up and then later <laughs> you completely, <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't say you got kicked out. <laughs> <laughs> all right thank you kingsley for this okay so this is where we are right uh so um guys uh this business is a very sweet business trust me uh it's something that can get to result. how do you join ecooperative.africa ecooperative of africa already explains an e-learning platform e-commerce platform what you need you don't give the money you don't give money to anybody what you do basically is that you you support somebody in the cooperative um, in the in the cooperative for you to be part of the business. You don't give the money to the company to support somebody in the cooperative to be part of it. So you need to have a sponsor. You need to have a sponsor. And that sponsor needs to have a referral link. So um, that's how you sign up. If you go to this website, www.ecooperative.africa, you can get a sponsor there. You can click and get a sponsor there. But if you don't, that's if you don't have a sponsor. But you need to work with somebody because that person will help you and guide you. What you need to be part of this business is that you need to have your phone number you need to have an email i need to have a bank account for now in nigerian bank account there's provision for ghana ghana we're working on something um the e-cooperative platform working something seriously on ghana for ghana and so on. so a lot of Ghanaians, cameroonians have asked us um asked me as a member and actually you know people are saying oh how about ghana we have not gotten any instruction yet from e-cooperative.africa and so we are still waiting but we are no we already know that they are bringing all of those things out for Ghana, for Cameroon. All right, we're still having a bit of um, a bit of a technical issue from back end of Dr. George. Please um, just stand by and um, be patient with us. We are still 
going to be back. Uh, something that is very certain is in the fact that um, Dr. George is going to be live for the next 30 days. You don't want to miss any of the days. So just book out your 9 p.m. to 10 p.m. probably or 10, 15 p.m. for these sessions because Dr. George is a well of encyclopedia. He's a well of knowledge. I mean, All right. So you're, you're, when you when you work with Dr. George, you're so sure that you're not just going to do business, but you're going to grow. And um, my excitement, it's beyond the e-cooperative, is that in the next 30 days, if you sit down and you committedly and consistently show up here every 9 p.m., you are going to have a 20 years wealth of experience put together in 30 days for you, for your business. And you know what that's going to do for you? It's going to blow up your business. It's going to make your business grow. And I'm not talking about network marketing alone. I'm talking about you being able to use this knowledge as a person to also grow your different businesses. So um, when I saw the flyer that in the next 30 days, Dr. George is going to be up and running every night, then I just knew that um, it's time for my business to go to the next level. I'm just talking to stand in for Dr. George. We really apologize. You know how the network can be. That's why a lot of us need to make so much money so that we can put together and kick some network providers out of Nigeria and put the right thing. You know, sometimes when we have, um, with due respect, I don't know if they are listening to us, but we're telling them our mind. You know how foreigners invest in a country, they don't really have the feel of how it is thank you so much <laughs> all of you are saying you love my voice thank you so much i appreciate um you know how it feels when you are have a foreign investor in your country they don't really understand how you feel but if you're the one running the investment yourself in your country you understand better so we need to make a lot of money and we need to make that money pretty pretty quick and pretty fast so that we can do the right thing not waiting for the government so like i was saying um dr george um is going to be talking about the psychology of selling oh my goodness you don't want to miss that the psychology of selling alone do you know you can actually sell without saying that you want to sell Yes, you can actually sell without telling the person you are trying to sell. How do you do that? One of the things you do is that you get into the emotions of the people. Um, I think somebody introduced himself as a copywriter and then they know what I'm talking about. You know, so um, storytelling is also a way of selling. So you tell your story. You know, um, I speak and I coach and I do different um, consulting services for my clients all over Nigeria. And one of the things that got me into the industry was my story. And I learned my story from how, um, Les Brown shares his story. You know, he has this unique way of saying, I have a dream, you know, or, and then he talked about um, be hungry. You know, th those are some of the people that inspire me when I'm talking. So um, when we talk about psychology of selling, we're talking about storytelling. People kind of resonate with you, tell them stories. They kind of understand when you tell them stories. You, you know, um, I wish I can summarize a compensation plan, but let me try and see what I can do. All right. so. Um, e-cooperative is a simple plan with 2000 era. I mean, urgent to kill, like urgent, urgent to kill. Let me talk like in Nigeria, like como urgent to kill. That in some places cannot buy you pizza. Sometimes they cannot even buy you a good, a good cold stone ice cream for you and your babe or you and your fiance or you and your wife on a good day. So with your 2000 era, you sign up into e-cooperative. What's going to happen is that you're going to give that money. You are not giving it to e-cooperative. You are giving that money. You are donating that money to someone that has already joined the system before you. So it's like a cooperative of people coming together to contribute money for individual, for each other for individual purposes and goals. So I don't know what your goal is. Probably you're here and you're, you're hoping to get married by December. You don't know how it's gonna happen. Well, I wanna say them congratulations because here is the place. So e is gonna help you make that happen. How is it gonna work? You just sign up with 2000 Naira. As you sign up with 2000 Naira, you're gonna be directed to donate that money into someone's account. And that person that you donated the money into his account, you know, um, and then the e is expecting that you also refer four people into the system those four people that are joining the system are going to be the ones oh i think dr george is back and he's going to take it further but then okay okay dr george over to you sir i think okay i think um um dr george is not back okay so um that's the plan that's the plan on the platform there so you sign up with 2000 era oh can you pull back the plan can you pull back the plan don't take it off 
until the yeah, let it be that. Okay, so with 2000 era, that's you signing in. That's number one. <laughs> he said he wants to hear the marriage part. <laughs> okay, the marriage part is if you're planning to get married, and you know you cannot get married in Nigeria without money. So we're talking about how you can raise money to get married, how you can raise money to pay your school fees, how you can raise money to take care of your kids. So we said the plan, look at the screen, you could see the plan. With your sign up, you sign up with 2000 era. That 2000 you are not giving it to e-cooperative so you don't say I, I gave the company no 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 the company is creating a system where everybody benefits from each other so with the 2000 era you're going to transfer that 2000 era and pay to somebody up who's going to confirm your membership and that makes you join the platform now when you join the platform the e-cooperative says you are going to sign up with four people you're going to refer four people sorry refer four people into the system refer four people and the easiest way to do it guys i don't know who's with me but i'm ready to blow how am i going to do that just take the link that dr george is going to be talking about for the next 30 days and share it to all your contacts on whatsapp monitor them make sure that every night in the next 30 days not less than four people keep joining there's no how four people times 30 days that's 120 people that you're not going to get more than four people sign up let's even say it's in a month but i'm sure that within a week or gen 2k now if it will i'll be not be so if it dash anybody say and then you can just use that to sign up so those two people that those four people are going to sign up under you right those four people are going to give you two two thousand error that's they're going to pay it into your into your own account directly now when they pay it into your account directly for you to move up to the next level you're going to take four thousand error from that your money four thousand error from that your money that you have received and give it to your to the next person upward the the pyramid the, the sorry upward the the marketing scheme upward the marketing scheme so once you you are able to give someone four thousand error up front it means you're qualified to the next level now those four people that came in in your network i don't want to say under you in your network you're going to work with those four persons to also come in with their own to have their own four four persons now they are going to receive two thousand um, eight thousand error each right they are going to receive eight thousand error each and then they will take out of their eight thousand error four four thousand error again and send it to you and by the time you multiply that you would see the multiplier effect so this is a summary of how it goes and it continues like that by the plan which i'm sure if we don't continue today absolutely <laughs> so people are making me laugh <laughs> it's a live summer. all right so um but i'm pretty sure that by tomorrow dr george is going to piece this down every damn thing the point here in summary is that with your 2000 era you're signing up into the system and in the next 30 days whether you you like it or not there's going to be a millionaire somebody's going to start this business within the next 30 days and become a millionaire and make his first one millionaire in 2021 or make his another one millionaire in 2021 please who is that person going to be can i see your hand on the comment section if you're the one let me see you that in the next 30 days you are the person that is going to blow one million era plus i'm just saying one million no, because i know that definitely the system uh -huh. Uduk is saying that she's going to oh, the person is all right i'm seeing i'm seeing hands already beautiful so in the next 30 days with this 2000 era you sign up and then you also get people to sign up under you for people to sign up under you with two thousand i mean anybody can do that right but you know the beautiful thing you're not just coming to do money circulation no there are educational arm of the company there's the educational aspect of the business where you would most definitely learn a whole lot i mean a whole a whole lot <laughs> my brother in the spirit are right, beautiful so you can learn a whole lot so let me give give you the trick let me give you the trick guys don't sleep this night you know what you're gonna do Go to that your wallet and pick out 2000 era now, 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 and do the transfer. Ask Dr. George now, bombard whoever if you did not, if nobody, uh, if you didn't come directly to anybody, if somebody invited you, please reach out to the person. Now, what you're going to do with me is that make up your mind because me, I'd already do, I'm at already now. So they talk to you like this, I'd already. My name is Kingsley, and I like today, like Kingley, my style. So, what are we going to do every night? Just look out for the link. In fact, disturb Dr. To judge let the link come out like <laughs> 10 a.m in the morning you take the link to this and send it out to everybody that you know help them install zoom in their phone help them install zoom in see we're in the virtual world we don't need to look for where to rent a seminar space um a physical no 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 virtually we're doing our thing you know what i'm saying all right so so just do that as simple as that you just um get people to come and join you in the class so you are going to learn they are going to learn 
so that they will not say you self ah you don't even earn money at all you just keep quiet the guy will just be learn when he learn finish he will just sign up and when he's paying the money he's paying directly to you so some people by the end of tomorrow night you're going to get your first eight thousand error i think we're going to be struggling with testimonials and classes would you be the person to testify i don't know about you but somebody has to buy a new car somebody oh i can see a lot of hands glory again beautiful i see a lot of hands um, I don't know who's going to buy a new car, but I'm among the people that will buy. Who's that person that want to buy a new car? 2.5 million era. You just buy one simple car that you know you upgrade. Aha, uh -huh, I can see them. So what are you going to do? Just 2,000 naira. I don't want to use the F word now. <laughs> okay. Ubo said he's taking his wife to vacation. Amazing. See, who is getting married this year? We want to show up as Kubana Santi. You don't understand? Kubana <laughs> to the future. All right, guys. So that's the summary of tonight's session. My name is King Slimia, and it's been beautiful um, talking with you. Who are the Kubana boys? Join. Let's Kubana the whole thing. You don't understand? So um, yes, by the time your wedding. <laughs> yes. Uh, hello, King Slimia. Thank, thank you for this. Thank you for taking over. Thank you for um, um if you have question, please um kindly ask your question and uh, um let me ask, see what I can answer. Is there anybody here that has uh, one of the questions to ask? I have questions to ask. No question. No Having a lot of difficulty in this place. Can I talk? Can I say something? Who is this? Big? All right, all right, all right. So, so hold on, hold on, everybody, hold on, everybody, hold on, everybody. Can we mute our? Okay. Okay. Um. Why okay, is your question now? Okay. Um. Um, good evening or good afternoon, everybody, uh, wherever you are. Um, please, I'm having a, a, a big difficulty since I joined this platform because I've, um, from my first to second, third, fourth registration has not gone successfully. I only have, I have one person under me and uh, he registered. And I have three other persons under me, but they've not registered successfully. And they register, but they've not found the account. So, and they are just there stagnant and there's no way I can take them out. I try as much as I could to send um, a message to the support. I've sent message two times to the support, even as I'm talking to you, I'm still checking at my platform, but no response has been send back to me and i'm checking my email also nothing has been sent to me so i don't know how i can get these people these three person out of my platform so to bring um people that are competent to join the platform so that they can you know we can take the uh, platform to another level because i'm really really so angry that these people i brought them in but none of them is active so i'm kind of if there's anything the leaders can help me do let me get these people out and even my downline brought someone he brought about two person and i think two of them is not also um active so i'm trying to see how i can take all these people out to bring other people is is anything that can be done okay right, um thanks. thank you for your question um i think um the first thing first is um, this is for everybody. Try to make sure that, that those you refer are those who, who are really serious in the business. And yeah. um, you, can also call, yeah, well. you can also call those people. You also call them to encourage them to, see, um, to, to know the reason why they have, why they have not actually um, pursued the business and um, proceed. Um, but then just hold on for the, the admin. Um, they, will, they will reply to you. You send, you send the mail today, right? It has sent the mail since three days now, and they've not okay, replied. Okay. And you, and you said these it, people are support? people. Yes, yes. Is it to the support? Yes. Okay. What is the what is the username, please? My username is Frank Sutu. Okay, Frank Sutu. Okay. Um, I, I I will take note of it so that I can fully. My talk. my username is there. Is the one on my screen on my laptop. Okay. Okay. I will follow it up. I will follow it up okay. from there. 
because these people they, okay. they you know you know when you present something for them they want to join they 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 show this kind of uh, this flexible interest but right. when it comes in times of money they like yeah. and I, you can't okay. imagine because I'm a, okay. I'm a, I'm a, you know, a marketing true. person. Right. So I know how right. to talk to these people. So, but the, we the understand that when it comes in times of money, All right. they, they are, All right. you know, okay. 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 Thank you. Thank you. We'll follow up on that. Thank you so much. We'll follow up on that. And of course, we're going to have uh, membership trainings as well as time goes on. Thank you so much. So let's have Levy, Levy Madua. Madwa Buchi, Madwa Buchi, please can you ask your questions? Why every other person mutes their mic? Levy, are you on? Thank you. Levy, over to you. Hello, good evening. All. Good evening. Okay, just um, just for a quick question, I want to know. Um, I don't really know the. Uh, does it have a website? I yeah, of course know. we have a website. I, yes. You just want to have the link to it, so I can get you know. All right, so um, check on the comment section. Someone is going to drop the website on the com comment section, so you could click it. Um, just, just official go to website. E of Africa. The website e is ecooperative.africa. E That's the website. Look, and someone refer you. Um, try and get the person. Go back to the person and get the referral. The referral link from the person. Yeah, very true. It. Please, do, yes, those of us that joined this meeting, someone um, gave you a link, someone referred you. It's very important you reach back to the person for further clarifications. But if you just want to find out more, you can also check the ecooperative.africa and check more, more, uh, get more updates. Thank you so much. Let's have patience, Basi. Patience, are you on? Please, can you unmute your mic and then ask your question? Thank you. Patience, we're waiting for you. All right, so we'll go to the next person because time is really fast, friends. Let's go to Gloria O'Conn. Gloria, are you on standby? Could you please unmute your mic and ask your question? Or probably we've answered it already. But if we haven't, can you please um, ask your question? Gloria O'Conn. Gloria O'Conn, are you on? All right, so we have Glory and we have Patience Bassi because we have um, five more minutes, it's 10.30 um, p.m. and we will be wrapping this up. Okay, Gloria Cohn has dropped a message. Let me check. Um, let me check your message. Glory, what did you say? So my question has been answered. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Glory. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. So we don't need to repeat ourselves. Thank you, Glory. Patience, do you have any other question? All right. So ladies and gentlemen, um, every time you come online every night, there's going to be someone that has shared the link with you directly. Please do well. Um, it's very important you reach back to the person and get more clarifications and get to sign up. And then when you want to sign up somebody, please don't sign up somebody until the person is ready with cash so that they don't delay your, your flow. I'm sure Dr. George or the admin is going to take it up from here. Thank you, Hannah. Have a, ble a beautiful Hello. night. I, I have a question, please. Okay, what's your question oh, quickly? Okay, mm. good evening all, please. Um, good evening. I want to find out the best option in family signups. Um, there are people who are interested in doing more yeah. than an account. Okay. Um, yeah. So, what's the? I understand that every okay. one that signs up, mm. every account has a referral link. Okay. So, if you are doing a model, uh, what's the best model to take? Because not that every account, possibly from my understanding, should have four legs. So. Yes. If you're running a model from the sponsor, okay, uh, what's the best advice to tell someone who says, I want to pay myself, I want to pay for, I want to cover for my child, I want to cover for my wife, I want to cover for All my... All right. All right. That's Thank it. you. Thank you. So um, very clearly, the marketing plan says that you have one account and that one account expect that you refer four people. If you decide to say, okay, I have 10 family members and I want to sign them all of them up. Remember that each account cannot go without you also working and referring four people each. So if you decide to do four accounts, that means you're going to have to do four multiplied by four. So you're going to look for 16 fresh people to fill in those accounts, 16 fresh people. So um, don't be excited because the money is 2000 naira and you just say, okay, I want to um, cover my entire community people and register them. Be ready to do the work. Network marketing has is a system where you work in the beginning and then later you don't work much and then the thing keeps flowing. So I would advise that um, if you're signing up, um, whether you want to sign up your you and your kids or all that, just 
count them so that you know your timing and the effort you would have to put. Of course, we're doing corporate effort already where we're supporting each other through every night having this session for the next 30 days. And who knows, we might extend it. So if you are committed like I am committed from this night to pump in no less than five people to join the class every night, I'm sure if you had signed up yourself, your wife and your kids, which is like maybe four, then you need 16 people to fill up the first level. Once those 16 people are filled up that first level, with their cash, please, and have signed up, the rest will begin to roll in. I remember it's now building leaders. I think that's what I can advise. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Okay. I think, I think um, we are done, right? Any other question? I think no other question. Here. Dr. George, over to you. He has to say something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you, guys. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, okay, go ahead, sir. I think, okay, go ahead. Yeah, good evening. Good evening, sir. Yeah, the question I'm uh, trying to ask is, um, I'm expected to have uh, four downlines on my own, but the question is, after referring four people and I have four down lines, do I still need to keep sharing my referral link or I just need to work for my down lines? Yes, you can, you can keep sharing your referral link. What will happen is a spillover. The spillover will go to your down lines. People that okay. are your four will benefit okay. your, your four will benefit from that. Sometimes as a leader, if your if your four ends two okay. k without their effort, to encourage them to also um, continue to work, so you can keep sharing your link okay. or sharing their link. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. So there's a spillover. Are you ready, start? Are you ready, start? Yeah, I've registered and I have um, three downliners. One as page. I have two who are yet to pay. The other one, okay, so his account, so is giving me a cash, one-on-one -on -one cash, so he called me to come over tomorrow, so I will get to him. Okay. Oh, he's totally ready. Okay. Sorry. Ready. I think All right. Sorry. I think that, I think that my network, the network kicked me out when I was trying to give you our challenge. Challenge day number one, please write it down. Your challenge okay. for everybody, for everybody that has attended this class, we just have 26 of us here, or 25 of us. Um, challenge day number one, what is the challenge? If you have gotten your four people or three people or two people, the challenge for tomorrow, which I want you to do between today and tomorrow, is to call them and thank them for supporting your business. Give you, because he gave you 2,000 naira. You probably have used to do something or you're probably keeping it aside for something. Call them and thank them for supporting you. That is challenge number one. If you are in this business, and no, you have not signed up yet in the system, go and look for your upline or your sponsor. Tell him to give your link, him is a referral link, and then you can sign up with the person. Please sign up, like Kingsley said, with your own money. That is challenge number one. Also, also um, if you don't have a referral, you don't have someone that can refer you and you're new to this business, you got this link somewhere, you can go to the website and click on register. Excuse me, click on register and then you get started. That's talent number one. So if you have registered already and you have upgraded to level one or level two, and you don't have anybody at all as your down as your downline, and you don't want to just put any kind of person, what I want you to do for tomorrow, make sure that you invite at least those four persons to come and hear first when they hear. They'll make up their mind, decide to join your business, find, decide not to join your business. There's no problem. You can always invite another four the next day. Don't be in a hurry to fill up your four without making sure that they are qualitative, qualitative people. So we have a challenge, challenge day, day challenge number one. Because we see challenge, it has to be, there has to be a challenge, something to do for day one. Day one, if you have not registered, go to your upline, get the link, register with your money, and get started. Day, day one, if not, challenge one. If you already registered and you've moved to level one or level two and you don't have anybody in your downlines, invite them to come for tomorrow's training and seminar. We, all of us will be able to, to encourage them to join your business. If you already have your four, go to your matrix. Go to your matrix and get their phone numbers and their emails and call them personally, thanking them for supporting your business and telling them that you want to see how you can also help them to replicate. 
That is our challenge number one. Okay, so, the final, so those are the four things we're going to do tomorrow. The last thing I want to add is that there is a video, there's a video for the compensation plan. There is a, 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 a video, the audio, the text, all of it that we have said sharing. Go and get those materials and listen to it again and again. That is our day, our challenge day number one. So if you do these things for 30 days, do all our challenges for 30 days, trust me, your life won't be um, the same again. All right, thank you guys for all your support. Um, admin, um, admin, okay, that's the that's the thing to share. That's the link to share. That's the link to share. You can subscribe to the Telegram channel. Okay, you can make one million in thirty days. It's possible. And uh, challenge number one is just how many challenges? Is just one. Or you pick the one that you you are involved in. You just take one that you that you know is relevant to you, and you go with it. If you have not signed up, go and sign up. And register to level one. If you've already signed up and you don't have anybody, invite them tomorrow. If you have four people on your system, sign them up. Okay, sign them up and call and go to your matrix. I'll call them, call them, and then and, and see how you can um, thank them and see how you can support them. Tomorrow we're going to go to somebody's platform, somebody's um, platform, and show you the dashboard. Let me see. I don't know. My network has been so bad. I don't want to attempt to do it now. But I've lost love to show you the dashboard so you can see all those things we're saying. But let's do it again tomorrow. Thank you so much for your time. I wish I wish the admin would now take over from here. God bless you. Okay, good night, everybody. Good night. Thank you for joining. Uh, um, we we appreciate you for coming tomorrow by 9 p.m. We'd like to see you here. Invite as much people as possible to the Zoom training. Thank you. Have a wonderful night rest. Good night, please, Charles. I hope we keep to time. We shouldn't use more than 45 minutes for this meeting, please. Uh, because it's uh, because we are not going straight to um, to the marketing plan presentation, uh, we may take up to more, uh, we may take more than 45 minutes, but we'll try and stay on, on point. But you see, the beauty of it is that if we only do marketing plan presentation, you will not be excited to come. But when Dr. George is here to share additional knowledge that can help you outside e-cooperative, that makes it interesting. So, but we'll try and manage the time. And then, the, of course, you know the network issues. Thank you so much. We understand. Then 60 minutes should be maximum. One hour. Yes. Let's Okay, we are going yeah. to try. I want to apologize. We are trying. In fact, I even said we are going to do one hour less than one, as for every one hour. Presentation plan. One hour should be maximum. We will make efforts. In fact, we have overstretched. We have done thirty minutes extra. We started by nine today, but somehow we have done. And I must apologize. The network was also part of the issue, but I really will stick by tomorrow. Hopefully, we'll do sixty minutes at the max. At the max, please. Thank you so much, and God Thank bless. You, good night. Recording in progress. Oh, my God.